Hey there YouTube. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to bear bag. And uh, what you use this for is to hang bear, I mean to hang food away from bears up in a tree or to hang a bag up in a tree. I use this method to hang food and my hiking backpack when I go um, backpacking with a hammock. Because I have nowhere to put my hammock besides, on, I mean nowhere to put my backpack besides on the ground. And um, so today I'm going to be showing you how to do that. But first, what you need is a bag, a carabiner. I use a black diamond carabiner. I think I already said that, but whatever. It has a two ton rating. And I use a 100 foot paracord that's all connected together. I have different colors. Um, but what I use to for the loose end is orange paracord so that is how I see my cord hanging so if it was black it would probably blend in green will probably blend in any other color uh, red and orange are good but that's what I use I use orange for the loose end um, so you would connect your loose end to a pole or a tree and I use a bowling knot right here because I have something to stop my cord from coming off of my pole in your case a tree um, but what you could use is a two half hitch um, self tightening knot or anything like that so it doesn't slip off the tree if there's no branches or you don't have a tree next to you or you can just simply hold it um, justice here there we go um, and then you just got a bag with rocks in it don't carry the rocks with you but carry a light bag with you something that you can throw over you'll probably find the rocks or you can get dirt put that in the bag and then what you do is you just take the bag find a high enough branch and I like 35 feet or above so this is just a tree in my yard across from my fence so it's going to be hard to throw it and my neighbors think I'm weird because I always videotape but um, preferably a 35 foot branch off of the ground um, away from the middle tree like right there right there but that's not high enough this is just for purposes right now for sake okay so what you what you want to do, take your bag, like I said, 100 feet of paracord you should you should carry, or any type of cord as long as it's strong enough. Let's see, I don't know which one I should throw it at. I guess I'll throw it at that one right there. No, I don't know. Right there, probably. Uh, whatever, I'll try it. If not, I don't know. Okay, so you take your take your bag, take your carabiner, hold your bag like this, but with one hand, and then you just toss it up there. Okay, that one didn't work. And you just let your bag fall, just like that. And what you do, hopefully you saw all that. If you didn't, my cord is right there hanging. You can barely see it. Um, that's the OD green cord. All right, there. Sorry, I had to uh, get my bag across from my fence so I had to climb my fence but um what you do is once you got your bag all the way down you take um your bag with rocks off of the carabiner all right like just like that and then you take your loose end of your cord 
your loose end right here. Then you put it in the carabiner. Um, then you take the bag you want to hang, put it inside this carabiner, and then raise it up. So just for this purpose, I want to put the bag back on. But what you would be doing is put your the bag you want to hang on instead of the bag of rocks. Then you just hang it up and try not to let your uh, rope um, twist because then that's what causes friction. Then the bend, then the rope doesn't want to uh, um, slide down and up. Okay. So try not to let your rope twist together. Then you just pull your loose end all the way up. All the way up. Just like that. And you want to make sure, see if it falls, falls first before you do this next step. Then you um, take a piece of wood around wherever you are, preferably um, the width of your thumb and about a half or a foot long. What you do is you take you do this. Then you, re you reach up as high as you can and you just tie that on there. Then you give it a little wiggle and your bag should come down. And then, sorry for that sunlight shining, but your bag should look like this. And when it looks like that, you successfully done it. But make sure your stick is lighter than your bag, although it should be. I don't know who would be carrying around a freaking big stick or a light bag. Or I don't know. I'm just waking up right now, so I'm talking nonsense. But let's make sure your stick is uh, lighter than your bag because the uh, it's like a uh, that balance the weight balance it, the bag doesn't have enough um, power to pull down or pull up the stick like a pulley but that's all you do and then if you're if your string like I have a lot here but if your string is still um, not tight on that pole then you can just leave it there but I like to take it off and let it hang on the ground. And then that's all you do. So have a nice day. Thanks for watching.